Well, you, you mentioned Zika virus, so what, what similarities do you see, Tracy, as you, you look back and be, between West Nile and what's happening with Zika today? Well, once again, that we were taken by surprise. Um, <laughs> you know, uh, it, it, it is sort of ironic that we've spent hundreds of millions of dollars looking for the next emerging infectious disease, but, you know, we were looking in the wrong place. Um, and I think, um, you know, they, they always say cockroaches are going to inherit the earth. I don't believe that for a minute. It's going to be the mosquito. And with global warming, it really shouldn't come as a surprise that it's another mosquito-borne disease that's causing a problem. And, um, and just as during West Nile virus, I think we're still caught with our pants down in terms of our pest control programs and their funding. Um, we're not very good at preventing disease outbreaks. We're a very reactive nation, and we respond to outbreaks when they happen, but it's, they don't like to fund preventive programs, which would make much more sense in the long run, but it's hard to you know, uh, gain funding for those programs, and um, uh, that's why we're still very unprepared for, for Zika.